Well, experts are tracking some good chances of an El Nino winter for us in Arizona. And many people, you may have heard that around the office or your home, and you wonder, okay, what does that mean for us? Well, usually it means we're going to see more rain and snow across the state, kind of a more active winter. And this morning, as part of our Running Dry series, 12 News journalist Jen Walp is digging into what this does mean for our water storage systems with Salt River Project. Good morning, Jen. You have to tell us more. Yeah, good morning to you. So where we're live this morning at the 202 in McKellips and Mesa is probably familiar to you. It usually floods around the winter time and then the springtime when we get a lot of rain or snow here in the valley. And a wetter than normal winter is always beneficial for our dry desert. But SRP says it does come with some challenges and those are things they are watching for right now. Things like making sure people in the valley stay safe with the extra water releases and getting the most use out of the extra water. So this year, experts are watching forecasts and climatology predictions very closely as we could see more closures and flooding just like last winter. If an El Nino winter pans out like climatologists expect, then SRP says they could see more inflow of water into our reservoir systems. Right now, SRP is in the monitoring phase. The next step is just continued monitoring. Last year, there was one of the largest snowpacks the Verde Reservoir has seen in decades. So SRP started releasing water in early March to make more room. And if similar releases happen again this year, SRP says we will see impacts around the valley. You'd see the water come down to the Granite Reef Diversion Dam, and if it's a small release, it may stay in our canal system. But as it gets larger, it'll flow and spill over Granite Reef Diversion Dam and then make its way through the Salt River and uh, just continue downstream. And, and if it's a large enough supply, it, it can actually reach the Colorado River. All great news to hear in our dry desert. And SRP did tell me that our reservoir system is at about 82% capacity. So it's really healthy right now following the wet winter we had last year. And having two back-to-back -back really wet winters, it's not out of the question. But SRP says in this dry period that we're in, it really doesn't happen very often. So we'll keep tracking that for you. For our Live in Mesa, Jen Walt, 12 News, Today and Easy.